For more than 50 years, the Cridge Center has been helping Greater Victoria families, offering support to families in crisis, housing for women and children impacted by violence, services for those coping with brain injury, and assisted living for seniors and others who need a little help to get by. Many of their residents have lived rich, inspiring lives. V. Cooper takes a look. It started in kindergarten where teachers uh, noticed my art ability. Richard Gutierrez has been painting his entire life. That's a godsend to me to be able to create and it helps with the pain. He was in his 50s when admitted to hospital in debilitating pain and diagnosed with a form of Crohn's disease. That was just the start of his health challenges. My first day of retirement in uh, 98, I had uh, a heart attack. And then in 2003, I had my first stroke. 2004, I had my second stroke. Then, if that wasn't enough, I had spinal stenosis. And then to top off everything, I've had anal cancer. And I had treatment for it, so it's in remission. We have some really remarkable people living here. It was six years ago that Richard moved into the Cridge Centre for the Family. We support a whole wide variety of people and so what we say is love is the bottom line. We want to help the community wherever there's need. It's called Richard's Art Book. Richard has a self-published book of his art. When people come, I don't have to drag down the work. I, I show them from the book. But then they say, well, what else have you done? <laughs> His passion to create art shows in his love of music, too. Here with the Cridge Centre Bell Choir. Some of these folks had never played a musical instrument before, so it's really fun that they could have this chance at this stage in life. And it's so simple, but it's so good because you're making something. Sitting above the hundreds of canvases he's filled with colour are model airplanes that he built when he was still physically able. At 78 years old, his advice to us all, keep creating. Sewing, gardening, making something rather than being entertained. Some people take retirement, literally retiring from life. It's much better to make something. You feel that you still are worth something. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.